Here we are guys, here we are. Here we are, day three, compounding day. Oh yes. Oh yes indeed, there she is. All nicely washed down. She's gonna get another scrub today as well. So uh, let's go. Okay guys, right, we've got my uh, buffer, which is um, sticks to the Velcro, it's the Velcro pad. Uh, which works really well so an assortment of things that's this is what i used last year i'm going to use this sheet, uh, this pad for the tea cutting or compounding uh, there's my compound my marine uh, marine imperial compound finishing material works fantastic so uh, that's what i'm going to use and then uh, i shall be using this finishing material which is like a wax stroke polish uh, which again works wonderfully so all you need is three little dashes I'm trying not to bash my head three little blobs like that all right it doesn't need a great deal all right you, the reason you lay the pad on the uh, on the surface first is if you set the motor on to spin all that compound is going to splatter everywhere so uh, you'll lose most of the compound off the wheel off the uh, buffer so um, that's the reason why you do that okay so uh, like i say you only need three splashes just, yes let me just show you something that you'll enjoy i think let me just show you something a little trick i did do this in a video last year so if you want to see other videos um you know then uh, just look back um because all these little maintenance when you buy a boat it's not a matter of just putting it in the water and enjoy <laughs> it's a matter of uh, looking after it so let me show you this let me show you this you see this black bit here let's let's look at this black bit there okay these incidentally were caused by the harbour tires they instead of putting them flat on the harbour wall they put them so that the tires were sticking out so every time the boat sort of swung uh, um, starboard side the bow would hit the tires and that's why I've got the black marks okay so that's that's the answer to that one so let me show you this we'll put a little bit of compound on this towel all right and you got a bit on there but let me show you this it's like magic look at that hey that's how good this compound is okay now the that's into a groove there but it's coming off look as you can see it's coming off see and that's just by hand see how much this will clean up so look at that i've got a little bit more on on the towel so i'm just going to do that last little bit there there we are see hopefully the camera's picking this up for you i'll just give it a wipe there gone so if you can imagine if that's by hand what it's going to be like when you get the buffer on it it wouldn't take long at all so uh there you go so that's how good this compound stuff is all right so hope you're learning from this and uh, it's a help to you people if you've never done before i'm not a professional as you might have gathered um so anybody out there that's looking to complain or dislike or i'm doing these things wrong these are the things i've learned um uh by a first time boat ownership this is my fourth season as a boat owner um so there you are say we'll never part I love you for you alone were meant for me please give your love and heart to me and say we'll never part the 
the magic comes when uh, you wax and polish it. Honestly, it really comes to a wonderful shine. And you think, wow, I'm well chuffed with that. Smear it on. Beautiful way. Right guys, right, that's the part I've done, you can see a bit of a gleam there, like I say this is before wax, this is just purely compounding, um, but something, uh, I always have fenders hanging down here, and so you can see the little fine scratches on the surface there, that is purely from the fender, keep banging it all like that all the time, and rubbing against it, that's what that is, and this all these minor scratches were all here I've just compounded this top part and you'll see that they've all disappeared but I'm going to show you this now um, and what and compound these little fine scratches out and that's what compounding is all about guys all about okay right just compounded that so I'm just gonna wipe the old girl down get, see what uh, effect the compounding has had on the scratches So a look. Yep. You can see, you can see it's, it's pretty much gone. That's what it was like before. Okay, this bit here, the dull bit, and there's the shine on the other. There's the shine, you see? And as I move my hand along, it gets duller. Look at that, almost like a mirror finish. See? See how the shine's going look see so you can really see it there look look at that let's get rid of this towel Linda's doing a fantastic job baby aren't you <laughs> yes. hey yeah oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think we'll get back to compounding guys <laughs> right so yeah so there we are Hey, and don't forget to subscribe.